you might be knowing how to write the conditional operator for one condition true or false but let's see how you can do it for more than two conditions so we have created an lm class with red green and blue color and let's create simple method which will return a string for all the three colors okay so now guys we are going to create one more method where we are going to use the conditional operator okay so we are going to pass the color codes in them and then we are checking if the color code is equal to red then we are going to call the red method okay now we have two more conditions to check right the green and blue so let's see how you can do it so you can write again color codes is equal to is equal to color codes dot green if that is the case then you need to call the green method else you need to call the blue method okay so this is how the conditional operator can be written for more than two conditions okay let's call the determine color method by passing all the three colors so we should be getting the result accordingly okay so let's run our program so if you see we are getting the appropriate result